Mr. Stone, can we come in? Come in? Uh, hello, yes, of course. You know Mr. Thomas, our church warden. No, I don't. How do you do? <laughs> nice place you got here, Mr. Stone. Very nice. Oh, thank you. Yes, I'm very fond of it. I'm sure you are. So fond, in fact, you don't like to leave it on a Sunday morning. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, I'm, we haven't seen you at church these last nine Sundays, Mr. S. Ah, no. Uh, I've been quite busy, actually. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Mr. Stone. He's been rather busy, Mr. Thomas. I'm heartbroken, really. Mr. Thomas is heartbroken to hear that you've been kept rather busy. Well, you know, I, it's... Have you ever heard of Satan? <laughs> what? Satan? Have you ever heard of him? Yes. No, well, that's a start, isn't it? Well, I'm in a position to tell you, Mr Stone, that Satan is all set to devour this country of ours. Did you know that? Isn't it so, Mr Thomas? Absolutely, Reverend. Mm, Satan has got all peckish. Peckish, peckish, peckish. And he wants to gobble up all the little souls he can find. Gobble, gobble, gobble. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. Indeed. Let's imagine that this vase is your soul, Mr. Stone. <laughs> Along comes Satan. Gobble, gobble. Oh, yes. He can be a, a very messy eater. <laughs> was it a valuable vase, Mr. Stone? Well, yes, it was, as a matter of fact. Still, not as valuable as your soul, eh? Your soul is priceless. You should look after your soul. All you have to do, Mr. Stone, is go to church, Receive the sacrament of the Holy Eucharist, bang something in the offertory plate, and you are on velvet <laughs> in clover. <laughs> Laughing, safe, protected. <laughs> so if some Catholic or Baptist was to come round threatening eternal damnation, you know you'd be all safe and warm and snug. <laughs> I see. Right. Will we expect you at the Church of St Michael and all the angels next Sunday, Mr Stone? I do hope so. Oh, yes, yes, of course. Oh, what refreshing news. I am pleased. Good day to you, Mr Stone. <laughs> gobble, gobble, gobble. <laughs> <laughs> But I'm Jewish. 